and a member of the budget committee in the National Assembly, which is the Senate, and a member who is in the Revolution Committee in the Senate. I am shocked and surprised just the way my friend, Honorable Steve Mogaka, said on my colleagues who are here. We have been raising issues about our country, and we hope, <coughs> personally I've been hoping that somebody would have listened to what some of us are saying. Let me now tell you what Ms. Nyakango has done. She basically came out and said, the store has been broken into and the money is being taken. She said it. You guys are members of the media. So you had her say so. The consolidated fund is now easy accessibly available. The controller budget has no access to it. What we are talking about is that people who are doing their jobs are now being victimized and are now being taken to court. In fact, some of us who are critics of the government are expecting to, are expecting to be taken to court. Can they hurry up and come and get some of us quickly? Because we are not going to stop this nonsense. We will talk about the issues, we will raise them. Madam Nyakango has been saying it. We are mismanaging our finances and we are mismanaging our country. In a very polite way. I called one of my friends who is in leadership in the house. And I told him, what is that nonsense I saw? That was last week. He told me, and he sent me a message. He said, tell her to stop talking too much. What do you mean you tell her to stop talking too much? Some of us talk too much. You can't stop me. That's the job I have. I'm going to tell this government over and over and over that the things which you're accusing Ms. Nyakango of doing, that is the job you gave her. 